Christmas is a time of renewal and hope. The Delancey Street Foundation bases its very own mission on these principles. What better way to help celebrate one's own rebirth than with an annual Christmas tree lot? Joining us is Eric Meek, the organization's legal department head, and Justin Moyer, who's part of their moving company arm. Gentlemen, thank you for joining us, and happy holidays. Thank you. Same to you. Thank you. Same to you. I can't believe that we're talking about this already. The year has flown by, but this is one of the most important fundraisers, really one of the only fundraisers that you have. Uh, before we get into the Christmas tree lot, though, I wanted to establish what the organization is all about. Okay, well, um, we at Delancey Street, we're a two-year uh, re-educational program for ex-convicts, addicts, homeless, basically other people that have hit rock bottom. The Lassie Street is a place where we came to uh, learn to change our behaviors, change our decision making, so we could become responsible, you know, members of the community again. Absolutely, and this is their opportunity to, in essence, be reborn. So, how did you? Uh, pair the mission of Delancey Street Foundation with a Christmas tree lot? Um, well, really, it was a way for us to get face to face with the community, um, put ourselves out there uh, with our moving companies, landscaping, and just kind of help touch base with the community and help give back. Absolutely. And this organization, it is for both men and women. So if someone finds themselves who's hit rock bottom, what is the next step? Where do they then go? How do they find you? Well, um, we do have a presence on the uh, website. It's DelanceyStreetFoundation.org. Um, but usually it's by word of mouth, really. A lot of people that work in the field of helping others know about us. Um, a lot of people who've been through the program um, tell other people about us. And really, it's really easy to get into Delancey Street. You basically just have to show up here, sit on our bench, and get interviewed from, from some, some older members of the house. How long does the process take from that moment to when you are walking on your own two feet, holding down a job, maybe renting your own apartment? Process takes from the moment you sit on the bench and uh, get accepted through our interview, uh, it's a two year commitment. So um, anywhere from 24 months to 72 months. So it depends on how long you want to stay there. I see. And how did you gentlemen find Delancey Street? What was it that brought you to this organization? Well, um, I'm originally from Durham, North Carolina. Um, basically, I had hit rock bottom through lots of years of drug and alcohol abuse. And um, I had you know, lost everything. Um, luckily, I didn't lose my family, but I wasn't a good person to be around anymore. So through my family's help, you know, they, they wanted to find a solution, and I finally decided myself. I mean, that's one of the main things. You have to decide if you're ready. And I was ready to make a change. So we, found, we heard about Delancey through word of mouth. Um, and I, we drove down here and I sat on the bench to get interviewed because um, I, I needed that help and I was ready. How about for you, Justin? Um, basically for me, um, since the age of 22, I was in and out of jail and being in jail, we heard about the program and I guess I just kind of threw in the towel and I finally wrote Delancey Street. They came and gave me an interview there at the jail. They accepted me and to the judge, once I got released, I came straight here, and now I'm coming up on 20 months now. That's wonderful. So Congratulations. It was basically, I, I was just finished. I was tired of the way I was living, and I just wanted to be a better person and a productive father for my son. That's wonderful. Well, congratulations to both of you. You know, this organization, it's been touted in Parade Magazine as the world's most successful re-educational organization, and it, it, you're kind of relearning just how, how to work and be in society. It's pretty remarkable. It's just amazing. How many people do you think this organization has helped so far? Thousands. Yeah. Yeah. Through, uh, yeah. Delancey Street started in 1971 in San Fran. Our house here in South Carolina is actually the new, the youngest house. Uh, we've been here for about six years. But yeah, Delancey, there have th been thousands of uh, people that have gone through Delancey Street since it started. I can't think of a better organization to help and to buy a Christmas tree from. So back to those uh, Christmas trees. When do they go on sale and where do people find them? Um, we have two Christmas tree lots this year, one located at the Citadel Mall parking lot in West Ashley in front of Target, and the second one right in the heart of Park Circle. And they're going to be from November 27th to December 24th. Fantastic. And uh, are you going to have all the different varieties of Christmas trees? Yes, ma'am. All the way from four to five feet tall to 10 to 12 feet. Oh, fantastic. I love a good fir tree. 
Yep. We yes. also have wreaths available as well. Oh, wonderful. Excellent. Yeah. Well, gentlemen, thank you so much for sharing with us. And of course, we're going to share this information with our viewers. We're back in two minutes.